We're starting off in Decatur, where city officials held a press conference this afternoon to answer questions on the Steve Perkins case. This conference comes almost a month since Perkins was shot and killed by Decatur police as protests continue around the city. Part of the call for justice is the release of police body cam video. Our Sedona Meadows has been tracking this story for us in Decatur. Sedona, what did you learn today? Well, Kanisha, the biggest thing these city officials said during the press conference is that they do want to provide the community with answers, but they want to make sure that the investigation is done right. Now, this press conference was in response to the many protests that were held, you know, have been happening since uh, the death of Steve Perkins. Um, but one big one, one big protest that took place just one week ago was right here on the Hudson Memorial Bridge that blocked traffic going into Decatur. Now, since that demonstration, Several of the individuals involved in the blockade have been arrested for disorderly conduct. During the press conference, Fox 54 asked the chief of police about his recent press release saying they got some initial information wrong about the interaction with Steve Perkins. In a, an effort to rush some things, um, some things got to, you know, we're, we're wrong. And I had to take, take that back. And I want to make sure that we are thorough and have a complete and thorough investigation on this. And, and, and you know, yes, we want to be speedy throughout all this, but uh, we want to make sure we have it right. The message from the citizens of Decatur has been received loud and clear, but at the same time, an adequate investigation has to be completed. I'm here to make sure that's done, that it's done promptly, that it's done diligently, but that it's done fairly. Now, there have been some rumors of a potential blockade of the bridge again this afternoon, but since I've been here, I've been here since about 3.30, and I have not seen a thing other than a police officer that was standing by, as well as two protesters that were walking across the sidewalk um, with signs saying justice for Steve Perkins. But other than that, I have not seen anything as of yet, but we'll keep you updated. But uh, I will have more details about the press conference that happened this afternoon later tonight at 9. But for now, live indicator, Sedona Meadows, Fox 54 News.